out. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come, we ain't playing, it's the last thing on our minds Stop crying much if you really, really wanna stop crying Be safe when you're home, be safe when you're street It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat I never wear gold cause someone's always beeping by the fence I still cry much, came and give TNT confidence I had a dream in the dark, I had a dream in the spring I had a dream, I had a dream like my new There's king. a jungle out there and the hunt is on There's a, there's a, there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on A jungle out there and the hunt is on we gonna hunt you down. We gonna hunt you down. We gonna come, we ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really, really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always beeping by the fence. I still crying much came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream, I had a dream like my new There's king. a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come, we ain't playing, it's the last thing on our minds Stop crying much if you really, really wanna stop crying Be safe when you're home, be safe when you're street, it's a go Good evening ladies and gentlemen, this is Ian Allen, this is Crime Watch and we're back, top of the evening to you All those of you who are locked on the line, a special good evening to you Ladies and gentlemen, I got something to tell you, like big news, like big news You see, you see that's what I told you on Friday, that's what I mentioned to you, Mayaro what went on with the police and the, 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 not the Venezuelan nationals and Attorney Jared Ramdin, we, we, uh, we had a phone convo with him. And I indicated to you that, that these people were in, in Mayaro police station and they, were, they have been there for about uh, or, or days. Do you know, now you realize that they did a test over the weekend, Delta. Yeah, nobody wants to see. Now every policeman who interacted with these people and them, families, contact tracement, contact tracing, everybody have to go in quarantine. By the time the Minister of National Security thinking about Gary Griffith, somebody asked me today if I support Gary Griffith. I said, I mean, if I support Gary Griffith, What's here doing on me, boy? Yeah, but it's blonde. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Could be makeup brush. <laughs> hey, and I want to say thank you, Israel, my son. He did a cheesecake for me late yesterday. And I promise him, I'll come and eat it on the air. It is in real good. Is the boy cake this nice? He did a cheesecake for me. Good boy. Nevertheless, just as I said on Saturday, that here now, what you had these people and them lock up in a police station. So many police officers died. You know, we just had another police officer that died, right? Corporal guy, he was attached to um, Sandy Grandi CID. Is there a CG for him, please? Right, Corporal guy from Sandy Grandi CID passed away as a result of Corona. I tell you, no. one six three three four. Corporal guy attached to uh, Sandy Grandi CID, and I will tell you this, eh? I tell you this, nobody cares about police officers, you know. Nobody cares about police officers. Well, well what's going to happen with the police officers and them attached to, to Mayaro Police Station? Because they had a roadblock on Friday, and there were officers attached to the police station interacting with motorists, taking license, checking insurance, and whatnot. And everything and everything, they try their best to keep it a hush-hush. However, you realize now that the Delta variant, yeah, one person, now, just to let you know that today is Monday, the 20th of September, we have 106 confirmed cases of COVID-19. 
Yesterday, Sunday, we had three deaths. Saturday, we had eight. Friday, we had eight. Between Friday and today, we had 25 persons dead. Dead, dead, dead as a result of corona. Dead. Just imagine that. Um, also, ladies and gentlemen, Trinidad and Tobago has now recorded 10 cases of the Delta COVID-19 variant of concern with three new cases confirmed. The Ministry of Health noted the cases are non-nationals who recently traveled to Trinidad from Venezuela. Who come who traveling from Trinidad to Venezuela? Come out and tell the nation. Come out and tell the nation because one of the one of the Delta, one of the Delta came out of my Aero police station. One of the Delta cases came out, out of my Aero police station. So we don't know how that's going to spread up there now. And I didn't get permission to say this, but I'll have to call just to recognize a particular supermarket who sent food for the non-nationals there. And that's why I found that was very, very nice of them. For the kids and whatnot, they sent pampas. They had a nine-month-old baby. But just to let you know, ladies and gentlemen, they just dropped it. They didn't go into the police station. They just dropped it outside and, you know, they do what they have to do and whatnot. So no way they interacted with anybody. We just stuff coming in, drop it by the door and walk out outside the police station. They come, they collect it and they go on. So I need to, I, I, I mean, I didn't get permission to acknowledge the supermarket. And maybe I can talk to the supermarket owner shortly and find out that they like me, you know, just to acknowledge them. Because I, th I, I thought that was really, really great of them. So, just to let you know, Trinidad has now recorded 10 cases of the Delta COVID-19 variant of concern with three new cases confirmed. The Ministry of Health noted the cases are non-nationals who recently traveled to Trinidad from Venezuela, an unvaccinated minor and an unvaccinated adult. In the, in the instance of both the unvaccinated minor and the adult, the Ministry said investigation into the source of transmission continues. The presence of the Delta variant was confirmed via gene sequencing at the laboratory of the, of the Faculty of Medical Science University of the West Indies. Way boy. Oh. You know, I tell you this, sir. I tell you this. If I didn't come out and you and you know, the government's still thinking. And that's why I said you know. You remember when I came out with the helicopter? When I said that the helicopter was uh, the helicopter, helicopter was being transported, that Saturday the Prime Minister never came out. And you know, after I spoke on Friday, and I said, I said about the, I spoke about the, um, the, 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 the South African leader coming here for a state visit. I spoke about Mayaro, that nobody didn't know of what was really going on. He didn't appear on Saturday. And I said it on Friday. I don't know if we have that piece of the clip. Do we have that? Can I get it, please? Go ahead. Well, I don't even believe if he's in isolation. I really don't believe that. And in isolation, yeah, because you come good there because nobody has to ask questions. Yeah, he's in isolation. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has once again been placed on isolation after, after, being, after finding out that Ian Allen had information about uh, a leader and, and um. Uh, from South Africa, from Africa coming here. Yeah, and then also Mr. Allen spoke about um, Mayaro, Mayaro and non-nationals being housed at the Mayaro police station after the Prime Minister finding out about that decided not to come on Saturday. Okay? You understand what I mean, right? You understand, right? Because remember I said on Friday after Buzz Mark, he's not coming. He's not coming on Saturday. Listen to it. How long again? Okay, we're going to take a fast break. When we come back, we'll continue.
It's not just a sale. It's a craving for savings celebration. Happening now at all eight locations of Posada Food King Supermarket. Ensuring that you budget like a boss and eat like a king. In these tough times, we're committed to caring and treating for you like family by ensuring that you get the best quality product at the most affordable discounted prices. And at Posada Food King, your safety continues to be our number one priority. So remember when visiting our locations, wear your mask at all times. Properly sanitize always wash your hands as well as practice proper social distancing and follow all safety guidelines as advised by the authorities you have simply got to check out these great deals and savings available now at all Posada Food King locations Manzanilla Road Mayaro Tabakit Road Rio Claro New Grant two stores in Princess Town two stores in Point Fortin and Premier Street Marabella at the back of the Marabella Market download the Ian Allen app on any device via the App Store Follow the fastest growing Facebook page, Ian Allen Public Figure. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. We are live at 6 p.m. daily. And follow Ian Allen on Instagram. Join all our social media platforms today. Attention all contractors and homeowners. Beat the rain. Get your roofing materials fast. Shop at Varma Steel and collect your materials upon purchase or have them delivered the next day. Varma Steel for high-grade roofing sheets, purlins, steel beams, flashing, guttering, chain link, BRC, and decking sheets. Free transport for purchases over $5,000. Varma Steel's high-grade roofing have a life of 40 to 50 years. Varma Steel, next to the St. Margaret's Police Station, Pleasance Park. Call 659-4008. Whether starting off or changing your career path, Oshi's Health and Safety Training Center is the solution for you. Registered with the Accreditation Council of Trinidad and Tobago and approved by the National Training Agency, we deliver internationally recognized courses and certifications. We offer NIBOSH certified courses, IOSH approved courses, OSHA courses, approved HAZMAT courses, NSC approved courses and many more. Make a wise investment with OSHIS Limited. Accredited. Approved. Accepted. St. Rose Funeral Services. We don't just say we care, we show that we care. 24-7 removal services, international shipping and embalming, pre-planned funeral arrangements with complete burial or cremation, locally made caskets and coffins customized for your loved ones, wreath, floral arrangements, programs, prayer cards and mourners vehicles, maxi your car are all provided for your family's comfort. When you're leaving, leave in style. St. Rose Funeral Services, number 5 Bazalon Street, Tunapuna, 645-1075-337-9686. Allow us to honor your family members. Tired of choosing between healthy and delicious? Your search is over with the all-new O-Snacks Chewy Granola Bars. Locally made with fresh, wholesome ingredients that taste great and are good for you. An excellent source of fiber, antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals. Introducing chocolate chip, pumpkin spice, and almond cranberry. Our bars taste as good as they look, maybe better. O Snacks Chewy Granola Bars, the healthier choice. It's so long we're home. I have run out of clothes. I'm waiting for the Fab Ninja Expo to open. I just said they're opening on Monday the 16th of August. Finally! I was waiting for them since March. I agree. It's been so long. I'm craving the Indian food from Tandoori King. I'll have dinner at Dosa Diners and have dessert at Nanu's Kofi. I also heard they're opening three more restaurants. You know, we can only have takeaway due to COVID restrictions, but I can shop there. They've just added five more vendors as well. I always look out for discounts. Last Expo, I won a lot of vouchers. This time too, Queen Footwear is offering buy one get 50% off your second year. When are they starting? Monday the 16th of August, opposite the Medford Gas Station in Shigonas. Fab India Expo from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. Be sure to check us out. What sets us apart from the rest? Our dedication to provide you with a better experience and reliable results. Welcome to Central Imaging Center. We offer affordable CT scans, general vascular 4D ultrasounds, and breast cancer screening packages. All your imaging needs with reliable reporting and results. Call 39 Image Today. Central Imaging TT. Not just a better image, but a better experience. 
At B&H Tropicals, we make online shopping easy and affordable, giving you access to thousands of online stores worldwide with unlimited possibilities. No hidden charges, no sign-up fees, no yearly membership. Free delivery throughout Trinidad. Best rates in the country per pound. Ocean freight services. Brokerage services available for air and ocean freight. No hassle, no worries. Delivery straight to your door. For more information, visit bhtropicals.com. A world of shopping awaits. Shipping just for you. Home is where love is. Home is a peace of mind. Home is a house with the land to expand. At the serene Wakano Park or in the gated sanctuary of Ella Vista Gardens. Three bedrooms, two baths, indoor laundry and private parking. Starting at 1.275 million. 691-5659. 721-9186. TG Homes. Modern and luxurious living for all. Massive sale now on at RDK Welding and Fabricating Limited. Check out our latest doors, windows, gates and rails. Get 35% off selected doors. Over 1,000 designs to choose from. Or customize your design and we can create it. Visit us next to the Diwali Nagar or 198 SS Erin Road, Davy. Call today to speak with a sales rep. RDK Welding and Fabricating Limited. The king in fabricating. Everybody has taken us for fools in this country. That's fools. Everybody has taken us for fools in this country. Like, you know, the people like they're lost. Like, you know, we have we're here and all kind of thing. They're mashing up Gary. It's like, can I tell us something? Don't feel that the removal of Gary is just based on allegation and this and that and whatnot and whatnot. You know, you see, when Gary, see, when they get rid of Gary, that's the only thing standing between the government, the people, between the government and the people is Gary. You move Gary, you know what we're going to get? Ah, oh boy. Let me tell you something. Well, police will do what they want now. Once they have a head, once they have somebody, and they put, and they put somebody who's a PNM, well, that is it, party done, party done. What chance see they could come in your house, journalists' house, they could do what they want. They could do what they want. They could do what they want. That is why they want to bring African leader here to show them. Just see how they have them in, in, in different parts of the world have people. Like, you know, when, when, when the Benz and the and, and, and Tarash pull up, people run now in the dust in the street and they, hey, 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 hey. and you have nothing to eat home? Well, it's just a puppy show us here. Because I, I still want to ask the Prime Minister, you know, is it true? Is it true that people from, while we locked down in, 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 in while we have state of emergency right now, is it true that people come in here for state visit and we can't get to come out after nine? Nah, something wrong. Something wrong. Something wrong. Just to let you know what's going on in Mayaro. Residents, because they put me on a little chat from the Mayaro residence. Um, uh, GMRT ambulance has been busy whole morning with persons in PPE in the area. Just a while ago in the media briefing, the River Mayaro is a district of concern since the cases have risen significantly. Everyone be safe. And imagine the Ministry of National Security is supposed to remove those people and them and carry them down to the heliport to quarantine and they left them in the police station. Now there is an outbreak. Now there is an outbreak and they had seniors in the police station blowing all the little officers and them tell them if all you go home, all you have to do this, all you have to do that, all you can't come back, all you have to come back, all you have to do this, all you can't go on quarantine. Partner, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You have your mother, you have your father, you have your sister, you have your brother, you have your uncle. Any one of them die? Nobody, nobody in the police service can give you back your, 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 mother, um, your, mo your mother and your father. Full stop. Just to let you know that. And that is what we are seeing right now in Mayaro. An outbreak. And that's what I said on, that is what I said on Friday. That is what I said on Friday. And that is why I told you he wouldn't come out. He wouldn't come out. He wouldn't come out on Saturday. After all this happened. Go back to it. Let me get a, a, a little clip of it. Watch me. What I want to tell you today, when I buzz this mark, I don't know if Rowley will come and talk to the nation tomorrow, you know. Because you, you got to open up this place in a boss. I'm just telling you, you know. 
You gotta open up this place, you know. You see how you have real lockdown? Don't bring boy. You see how you have real lockdown? And we can open with business in the night and all these places that people go in the night and, and, and the restaurants and the bars and, and we can't even get no US because only the Syrians and them the one percent have access to US. All kind of thing. Exxon leaving, they're taking everything to Guyana. I thought we used to laugh at Ghanaian people when they say mattress. When they when they say when we say we laughing, they say they gaffing. I told everybody to laugh for them and I say, Guyanese is only come to Trinidad to thief your wear plate. Watch me. I'm going to show you how they're treating their own people in tongue right now, now, man. I want to show you. The last time they see the MP for the area was during the election. Let me show you what they're doing in Powder Magazine in tongue. You know Powder Magazine, right? In Powder Magazine is in Kokorit. Powder Magazine. Look what's going on. Who's the MP for that area? Simon Norbrega. Can I get a photograph of him? Look at MP, look at the MP for the area. Watch. Just imagine that. They say that they saw him only after, before election and that's it. This is what they have powder magazine outside. Look, I'm just showing you. Outside, outside, this is the garbage. The, the residents begging them to collect it. Begging them, they have rats, roaches, all kind of things. It's an eyesore. Put by the garbage, a, a, a dumpster inside the compound that persons who live in the compound could throw their rubbish and whatnot. Because everybody from around will go there. Out. It's obvious if you put a dumpster outside on the road, everybody from the district will come and throw it there. Put it solely for the those who live inside Powder Magazine. So I'm just showing you what's going on in Powder Magazine right now. It's a development in the Kokorit area. A house, a, a, a house in the area there, a housing development, an agency housing development, and it's really sad. The, the MP is, is doing nothing about it. The corporation doing nothing about it. Put back the dumpster, put, put the dumpster inside. And this is just failure by the government. You know why? You know why? Let me tell you something. They got their votes already. They got their votes already. And that is why you wouldn't come out and talk. But I have something to tell you. What I'm going to tell you today is the next mark I want to bust. You see, before you take the vaccine, boy, when I tell you this, this is going to shut you down, eh? This is going to shut you down. I am not anti-vaccine. I took my vaccine because I realized, well, thing, 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 I did interacting with people. I need to take my vaccine. That I still have, a, I still have the antibodies that could fight it if different variants out there and whatnot. Thank God. I do really have no comorbidities like high blood pressure and diabetes and, you know. Mm -mm. I good. Not good. So those of you who wish to take the vaccine, see a doctor. I want the Prime Minister, I want the CMO, and I want DR Singh to come out and tell the nation. You want to hear the mark today? Get a photograph of Professor Hubert Daisley for me. Get a photograph of him for me, please. Our court closed, eh? Our court closed. Let me tell you what went on. Sometime in August, a woman from South, she's about 56, 57, she took the AstraZeneca vaccine. Right? She took the AstraZeneca vaccine. Before the woman could take the second shot, she started to develop pain and whatnot. She started to develop pain. She started to feel sick. She had abdominal pains and whatnot. Huh. Boy, you know it has been confirmed. It has been confirmed that when she took the AstraZeneca vaccine. Now, remember, World Health Organization waited till about 10,000 persons globally died before they came to that conclusion that there are cases where those people who took the AstraZeneca may be blood clots and whatnot. But 10,000, but imagine there's somebody, mother and father, you know. Do you think you want your mother and father to be the next statistic, to be the one out of the hundred? Nobody want their mother or father to be one out of the hundred. This is Professor Deasley and I. We took on this picture many years ago. 
he was, you know, we were, somebody had hung themselves and he was doing the autopsy. So there's a photograph of him. Not related to, no, that, 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 that photograph is not related to this case, what I'm telling you about. And for the first time in the nation, in Trinidad and Tobago, there is a case now where a woman took the vaccine and she died as a result of the blood clot in the, in the stomach region. I don't, I, don't, I don't know the medical terms and whatnot. And today, it has been, it, there, there are individuals who don't want to talk about it, who don't want to come out and tell you. Because all the people would like to know out here, all we want to know, if you take the vaccine, be okay. It's like you can't ask a question. You bully me to take the vaccine. Not me, eh? nobody bully me to take no vaccine. But you're bullying everybody. But I just want to tell you that there is a case right now. An autopsy was done. And if you don't believe me, ask Professor Hubert Daisley if he did not do the autopsy and that was his finding. That is all I to ask him. That is all. I wouldn't call him on the air. I would not call him on the air. But there's the first case in Trinidad and Tobago, ladies and gentlemen, where it has been proven that after the woman took the vaccine, she died because of the blood clot all in her stomach and whatnot. Eh? Because the person was explaining using you know, the, the medical terms to identify the areas. I can't even remember. But all I know, it is the first case. And it has been pushed under the carpet. They want to push it under the carpet. But all I am asking you, I jump out today and tell you, Ask Professor Huber, because that, Professor Huber Daisley is a very distinguished man. That is one man I can tell you. Don't be no bacchanal. He not playing any politics. He play. That is a man love his job. And what, he's the kind of man, he's not looking for a friend. He will call an ace an ace and a spade a spade. But what I found out from certain sources, not from him, that an autopsy was done a couple days ago. When I say a couple, just a few days ago, that it is the first case in Trinidad and Tobago where it has been proven after the autopsy, the person died as a result of taking the vaccine. The CMO, the Minister of Health, the Prime Minister, nobody wants to come out and tell you. And today, I come out and tell you. Today, I come out and say that is what happened. Yeah. Yeah. Just how I come out and tell everybody helicopter, nobody didn't know. Just how I come and tell you that today, it have an outbreak in Mayaro because the, the, the non nationals that came in, they interact with the police. The police carry juice for them, they carry water for them. SNS, Passad supermarket took groceries to them. They didn't interact with them, but they dropped it at the, at the entrance of the police station. And groceries and, well, well food items, cornflakes and milk and pampers and whatnot. I think they dropped food stuff and thing. And I must congratulate our advertiser, SNS Passad. Sunita, we, you know, it was very nice of you and very noble of you. I must identify Sunita from SNS Passad. But I'm just showing you if I didn't come out and tell you, if I didn't make a big bram about it, Saturday morning results came back, you know, showing that, and come out and tell the nation, they wouldn't come out and tell you, but the Delta variant came from Mayaro Police Station. How I know that? Ah, oh God. How I know that? It's how I could tell you today. The first case in Trinidad and Tobago has just surfaced, has just surfaced, an autopsy was just done by the very distinguished Professor Hubert Daisley that the woman from South, I could zone in from Penal, David, died as a result of taking the AstraZeneca. And that distinguished professor, he will put everything in literature. Yes, he's not going to cover up nothing. And nobody, listen to me. Somebody asked me if 
Next one, this man said, I'm not true. He will never say that. Because my sources are very reliable. And 100%, 100%, how do I know about the state visit in the first week in October while we locked down? While you can't go to the beach, while you can't go to the river, while you can't go nowhere and bring in people, African leaders to Papi show we, and say, oh, we, 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 are we here and we here? Nobody from Trinidad tell me that, partner. People from outside, outside of Trinidad and Tobago, shoot a call. And today I am letting you know, let us ask the CMO, what, what is this that I am hearing about the woman from South that died after the only case, the only case in Trinidad that can really predict, uh, that, that telling you now, it is the vaccine, is the autopsy that was conducted a couple days ago. Don't ask me how I know. Don't ask me. As I said and I stand before you today, I are caught close. I wait in. I so sure. I am sure as I am hot looking. I am so sure. Let's take a break. Quality, selection, and the lowest prices are available at Lal Sawmill Limited, SSRN Road DB, for the finest lumber to suit your needs. Teak, apple mat, cedar, mahogany, and a large variety of hardwood. Our services include resawing, edging of lumber, planing of lumber, and cutting of logs. Also now available are teak king post, bed legs and wooden balusters. Visit Lal Sawmill Limited, SS Erin Road, DB, or call 316-4416. Naturally Fresh Foods Limited is a supermarket for you. We carry the highest quality foods at the most affordable prices, giving you value for your money. Stay safe with our curbside pickup services. Check out our Facebook page, WhatsApp your grocery list and collect within three hours. We have a wide range of fresh produce and packaged products. Come in today at number 10 Bonaventure Road, Gasparello. Also available at Green Hill Foods, Princess Town. Orange Cell Tech got you protected from the COVID-19 virus. Get all your face masks, adults and kids from the leading supplier in TNT. Blue, black, kids, pink and blue. KN95 mask, $5 each. Visit us at Gulf City Mall, San Fernando. Tricon Commodities Limited is your one-stop shop for batteries, tires, alignment, automotive repairs. Located at 57 Tragic Road, Porter Speed. We are the sole distributors for Aurora and Alpha Line range of batteries. Authorized resellers for AC Delco batteries and lubricants. We have tires for all applications with the most advanced alignment machine in Porter Spain. Tricon Commodities Limited, the best prices, excellent service, and lots of parking. Call us today at 628-334. Experience the thrill of the grill at The Ranch, located at Trinity C3 Center Shops of Arima and opening soon at Brentwood. Fast, convenient and efficient service, delivery available via the Food Drop app. Visit or order today. Come to light in a relaxing staycation at the beautiful Serenity Hills Palace. Nestled in the heart of South Trinidad, you can enjoy quiet scenic views. We provide spacious, fully furnished air-conditioned rooms with accommodations for up to 15 persons. Enjoy a day at the luxurious poolside, fully equipped with an outdoor kitchen, barbecue grill, poolside bar, and lounge areas. Overnight and day passes are available to fit your staycation needs. Find us on Facebook, call or WhatsApp 1917-239-5799 to book your stay. Do you know just how important tires are in getting the maximum performance from your car? Dunlop, a leading manufacturer of ultra-high performance tires, carefully designed grooves and blocks for more rubber-to-road contact. We at SNS Prasad know the struggles and fears of our beloved customers during this time. To guarantee the safety of our customers and employees, we have implemented routine cleaning of all our stations, lanes, trolleys and baskets, security to ensure the observation of COVID protocols and sanitizing stations throughout the grocery. We ensure our shelves are always fully stocked with a wide variety of cooking, cleaning, household and clothing items to meet the needs of your treasured family. For your convenience and safety, you can call and collect through curbside pickup or get one of our to-go bags containing the basic necessities or even better, place an order for your groceries and have it delivered to your doorstep where we accept both cash and links. SNS Passat, Rio Claro and Mayaro, we are here for you. 
RDK Welding and Fabricating is your only choice for windows, gates, handrails and more. We have expert craftsmen on hand to fabricate any design with the highest grade materials at affordable prices. Check out our latest sale on heavy duty security steel doors. Visit us next to the Diwali Nagar and Shikwanas or call 317-2236 or 719-0115 to speak with a sales rep. RDK Welding and Fabricating Limited, the king in fabricating. RNJ Celtech got you protected from the COVID-19 virus. Get all your face masks, adults and kids from the leading supplier in TNT. Blue, black, kids, pink and blue. KN95 mask, $5 each. Visit us at Gulf City Mall, San Fernando. It's so long we're home. I have run out of clothes. I'm waiting for the Fab Ninja Expo to open. I just said they're opening on Monday the 16th of August. Finally! I was waiting for them since March. I agree. It's been so long, I'm craving the Indian food from Tandoori King. I'll have dinner at Dosa Diners and have dessert at Nana's Kofi. I also heard they're opening three more restaurants. You know, we can only have takeaway due to COVID restrictions, but I can shop there. They've just added five more vendors as well. I always look out for discounts. Last Expo, I won a lot of vouchers. This time too, Queen Footwear is offering buy one get 50% off your second year. When are they starting? Monday the 16th of August, opposite the Medford gas station in Shigonas. Fab India Expo from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. Be sure to check us out. Marketing Company Limited and view our large stock of ready-made wrought iron designs. Visit us at 44 Montrose Main Road, Chukwana or call 235-4283-GATE or 235-4766-IRON. For generations, hard work and good advice have been essential. So when hard work gives me tough pain, I rely on Panadol Ultra that relieves fast five types of tough pain. Take good advice. Take Panadol Ultra. Find your trusted Panadol Extra Strength with a new look and new tablet. Attention all bakers, doubles vendors and roti makers. Try our high quality bromate free, all purpose and whole wheat flour. Low price and conveniently packaged in 2 pounds, 2 kg, 10 kg and 25 kg bags. For wholesale and retail prices, contact Shikmisho Limited at 665-3336 or 4808715 or visit us at Warrenville Canopia. Shikmisho Limited, quality you can trust. Clean your septic with Mr. Septic, the lowest prices in TNT. We also do residential and commercial plumbing maintenance, sewer pump repairs, clearing of chokes using our modern equipment. No one beats our septic cleaning prices. Quick, reliable service nationwide. Save money today. Call us now at 684-0933 or 714-3065. You won't be disappointed. Come on down to Adams Optical where we offer free comprehensive eye exams with free frames and a three month payment plan with no interest. We have a wide selection of frames and shades for everyone and we also specialize in contact lens examination. We are located at RRM Plaza on High Street San Fernando and 91 Montrose Main Road, Chagones. Find us on Facebook or visit us in store. Adams Optical. Also, ladies and gentlemen, I'm happy that I, that I highlighted that case in Powder Magazine in Kokori there. Look at the condition of that place. They have children around. They have kids playing. They have flies. This is what, it looked like somewhere out in maybe somewhere South Africa, somewhere, 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 some deserted area. Look at that place now. And I'm in South Africa, but like somewhere, somewhere in some jungle, some kind of thing. You can believe that part of Spain, part of part of Spain, and look at that place now. These people and them in that area, that PNM stronghold in So I wonder if you're gonna put up this man in the MP as a person of interest. Last scene. It could be who responsible. He's the MP for the area. Don't come and tell about no cooperation. They don't even see the man. Huh, talking about seeing, talking about seeing. You know Wednesday, this thing happened in Windsor Park, Wednesday, watch this. House collapse in Windsor Park, watch that. That Wednesday, right? House had a crack, all kind of thing went on. Wednesday, yeah? this is Wednesday. 
Wednesday, the place collapsed. People had to run from their house. You know when Donna Cox visited them people and them? You know when Donna Cox visited them people and them? You know when they had the flood in tongue, they went the next day as the water started to subside. They went the next day. You know when Donna Cox and visit? You know Donna Cox and them went Sunday? Sunday? But you feel I was going to put them on camera? Waste of time? Donna, you get your backdrop? Where your backdrop? Donna Cox, may I see your backdrop? <laughs> I seen fig tree and thing. You change it? Eh uh eh. -uh. Oh, that the people place are touching change. She come with a new backdrop. No, you have to put them up on blast Sunday. 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 Because it is a UNC area. Because, because, that, because that is David Lee constituency. I don't want to hamper. Will you give me hamper for my house crack up? My house crack up. Will you give me hamper for get, get, get me relocated? Get me into a place with Gerard Ramdin and them went down by these people and them somewhere in south. And after right seven and these people don't get too lot of land if the people who are affected. That is what that, but that is what I want. I buy my house, I buy my land, I build my house. All they have illegal um so, not not illegal quarrying. Government have a quarry down there. EMBD that falls under EMBD. All the quarry, my house crack up. Don't bring not nothing. I don't want a hamper. I want I don't want a grocery. I want a house. And that is how we are to get on. I want a house. Don't come on, mama guy me. I want a house. I want I want real. Don't put me in. Don't put me in a wele wele area. In no crime crime zone. We are smoking weed and selling gun and thing by the step. I don't want that. Keep me back in Shogunas. Keep me back in Kuva where I'm from. So 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 just to let you know. The minister visited the six affected families along with a technical team from the military on Sunday 19. MP for point up here, Dr. David Lee also joined the minister as she toured the area and saw for herself the extent of damage done by the recent landslip. Lee said he was happy that Minister Cox took time off on a Sunday. Quite Sunday, she now gone. Just imagine that quite Sunday. Quite Sunday you now. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Quite Sunday, you go with a little red bag to get them. Minister Cox also bet you work with other agencies such as the Ministry of Housing and Urban Development Housing. This happened on Wednesday, you know, but you watch me. People don't want, people don't want, people don't want no handout. What people want there, tell me which part, where you put me. Because, I, because remember, I buy my piece of land, I build my house. But because all you have a quarry, and people quarrying the government, that is the government quarry, it's it, it breaking up my house. One house collapsed, other house started to crack up and all kind of thing. It the, the whole soil is compromised. Don't come and give me no, no, no hamper. Tell me, well, here what's going on. In one month from now, we got a place ready for you. That is what we want to hear. That is what I want to hear. And that is what David Lee should be telling her. And telling the people, let them know we want a house. That is all. Let's see how the front. An unidentified man was shot and wounded along the southern main road in Enterprise this afternoon. Central Division gang unit responded and conveyed the victim to the Shogunas Health Facility. The suspects made good escape in a black Hyundai bearing false number plates. Also, a 31-year-old man was shot dead this morning in Belmont. A Sim Webster of Upper St. Francois Valley Road was shot and killed while at St. Bob's, around 11.30 a.m., Reserve St. Bob's with several gunshots. And also, ladies and gentlemen, if you didn't know, if you didn't know, a toddler, a toddler, a 15-month-old toddler died after she was chopped during a domestic dispute in Tarde last night. The victim identified baby Saraya Williams was chopped on the head at the authorial St. Martin home on Wednesday. The initial report indicated that around 8.15, the suspect was lying in the gallery at the baby's home with the baby grandmother and mother. He began arguing with the grandmother before going inside and returning with a cutlass. The man allegedly attacked a 50-year-old woman who was holding the baby, Saraya, at the time, striking the toddler to the head. The 50-year-old woman sustained wounds to her wrist. The suspect was subdued by other relatives and the 50-year-old and the toddler were both taken. However, baby Saraya succumbed to her wounds at 10.23. The toddler sustained a chop wound to the right side of her forehead and face, resulting in a fractured to a skull, the suspect was arrested. You see, you see, back and all in the back and all in. 
swing in cut glass and let the cut glass kill the child. You see, there's that kind of mad place, boy. Real mad place, you know. Real mad place, real mad place. Also, police are investigating the murder of a man who was shot dead, who was shot dead on Saturday morning, Scarney. Dean Rodrigo of Tunapuna was gone down along Carney South Bank Road in Kelly Village on Saturday 18th. Around 7.45, Dean was walking along the roadway when he was confronted by an armed suspect. Gunshots were heard. Rodrigo was seen on the ground and bleeding from multiple wounds. Also, an unidentified man was shot in Arangues on Friday night. Residents of Freddy Street reported hearing several loud explosions around 8.10 and on check-in found the man body in the roadway on Friday, the 17th of September. And you know what was really sad on Friday, ladies and gentlemen? A family dispute is believed to be the motive behind the murder of a Claxon Bay mother and a 21-year-old daughter who were both shot in the head on Friday. 60-year-old Savitri Soklal and Ariana Sandipa Balgobin of Solidad Road were shot dead at their home on Friday the 17th. I also had sent the cameraman so we could have gotten a, a, a day shot. So apparently they are contractors. A report stated around 4, 4 10 p.m. Police officers responded to a report of gunshot at Solidad Road on arrival. The officers met a male relative who informed them that he was at the home around 2 48 when he heard a man shouting. The man reported, said, I come for my money. Where my money? Where, my, why, where your son? The relative told, told police he then heard several loud explosions and contacted the St. Margaret's police station. The officers found Balgobin in a sofa in the living room with an apparent gunshot wound to the head. They made further checks and found Sukla's body between the kitchen and washroom area. She also had an apparent gunshot injury to the head. The district medical officer visited the scene and made a pronouncement and ordered the removal of the bodies. Investigators said Sukla's husband died from a heart attack last June leaving his possession to his family. However, there have been disagreements with several family members since then, as well as issues over finances. Officers of the Homicide Bureau Region 3 are investigating. 18 women have been killed for the year so far. Also, this is the 13 double murder for the year. That is real sad. You see, every day I come and tell you. You see, every day I come and tell you. When you see husband dead, or mother commanded and in laws you see you know what is bring you see watch me you see that land thing and that money thing boy it's bring all the devil in people you know the devil you know who go in these people house and shoot them in the head that is craziness and also just to let you know the guy who was shot in Golconda where, where is it Anil, Anil Dad Gazabo of St. Charles Road, Princess, so was gone down along Golconda Connector Road around 3.50. Officers responded to report of explosions along the Golconda Connector Road. Upon arrival, they found Gazabo in a hammock. But you know, ladies and gentlemen, I met him already. Yeah, I think I was at a party at night. I know which party to go. I can't tell you why I take that picture. Yeah, and that's him there. Yeah, so I met him there. So I was in a line, I was invited. So I have a, I have a life too, so you know. My, I have to go to pictures with thousands, and I mean, every day, every step I make, I take, people take pictures of me, every step. That's why I don't go to malls and whatnot. But anybody who have information with respect to killing of that man, get in contact with me. So now, ladies and gentlemen, you figure out now, there's the first case also, just going back, the first case, and nobody see him, no come out, the other thing I come out, Raul, here come out and tell you that the first case, the first case officially in Trinidad and Tobago, where it has been sh shown that the woman died as a result of taking the vaccine. Don't ask me how I know. The, the, the autopsy was done by Professor Hubert Daisley. My good friend. I didn't talk to him. So don't ask me how I know all that. But I know he wouldn't deny it. And just to let you know also, 
My boy didn't come on Saturday to, to, to tell you. Because he know you have to answer. How we have a state visit and this place closed down. How you have people from Kenya coming here, state visit the first week in October. And secondly, the Delta variant, the Spanish case, when they say people traveling from Venezuela to Trinidad, what you need to tell them is these are the people that was housed in Mayaro Police Station. So those are three things that you just found out on TV. Eh? Those are three things that you just found out. Let's take a fast break. Along with Alignment Center for One Stop Service, 3D Wheel Alignment, Tire Repairs, Balancing and Installation, Mechanic on Site, New and Used Parts and Stock, Oil Tires, Rims and Accessories. Located at number 7 Rambage Street, Alangres, One Stop Service for All Vehicle Types. Organifi Red is the new superfood with three proprietary blends. The antioxidant blend fights the effects of aging by reducing cellular damage, boosts your well-being and lower fatigue with the endurance blend. Lower inflammation and increased metabolism with the metabolic boosting blend. Available in pharmacies nationwide or contact Radiant Health and Fitness, the sole distributor for Organifi and TNT today. to get up that's for you and that's for you feel better mom Panadol multi-symptom relief in minutes seven cold and flu symptoms Panadol multi-symptom a dose of efficacy and care <laughs> set out to explore the reaches beyond our world. They needed a material that would hold up to the demands of the unknown. Flexible titanium. Engineered from the same alloy used for missile heat shields, Flexon set the new standard in durable eyewear. Flexible titanium eyewear. Available at Neo Eyewear, 91D Main Road, Suite 1, Montrose Mall, Chagonas, 672-5052 or 390-3196. Sukai's Diesel Service brings you outstanding and exceptional quality. We carry original parts, diesel pump and injector overhaul, diesel pump and injector testing, machine shop services, complete diesel engine overhaul, engine dyno testing, turbocharger repairs, government approved vehicle inspection stations. We are the premier source for all things diesel. Call us today for an appointment, 671-0900. If it's diesel, it's Sukai's Diesel. It's so long we're home. I have run out of clothes. I'm waiting for the Fab Ninja Expo to open. I just said they're opening on Monday the 16th of August. Finally! I was waiting for them since March. I agree. It's been so long. I'm craving the Indian food from Tandoori King. I'll have dinner at Dosa Diners and have dessert at Nana's Kofi. I also heard they're opening three more restaurants. You know, we can only have takeaway due to COVID restrictions, but I can shop there. They've just added five more vendors as well. I always look out for discounts. Last Expo, I won a lot of vouchers. This time too, Queen Footwear is offering buy one get 50% off your second year. When are they starting? Monday the 16th of August, opposite the Medford gas station in Shigonas. Fabbing your Expo from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. Be sure to check us out. It's not just a sale. It's a craving for savings celebration. Happening now at all eight locations of Passada Food King Supermarket. Ensuring that you budget like a boss and eat like a king. In these tough times, we're committed to caring and treating for you like family by ensuring that you get the best quality product at the most affordable discounted prices. And at Passada Food King, your safety continues to be our number one priority. So remember when visiting our locations, wear your mask at all times. Properly sanitize always wash your hands as well as practice proper social distancing and follow all safety guidelines as advised by the authorities you have simply got to check out these great deals and savings available now at all Posada Food King locations Manzanilla Road Mayaro Tabakit Road Rio Claro New Grant two stores in Princess Town two stores in Point Fortin and Premier Street Marabella at the back of the Marabella Market Get delicious meals and cold drinks at Double R Restaurant and Bar. Enjoy local cuisine daily and our Saturday Riverline menu, Fireside Duck, 
Cascadoo, Goathead, Lagoon Rice, and more. Delivery available in the Shibuanas area. Call us today for more info. Ladies and gentlemen, there's an election in um, election going on in Canada right now. Eh? A 36-day um, federal election campaign has come to an end as Canadians cast their ballots today to determine who will form the next government. Incumbent Prime Minister Justin Trudeau called the snap election in mid-August, barely two years into his minority government, betting he could capitalize on handling the, of the pandemic to win majority in Parliament. What, but once favorable polls for Trudeau, Trudeau and his Liberals quickly reversed course. Conservative Party, Aaron, fighting his way into this. So this is what's happening right now. Have a little video. Well, the day is finally here. Canadians cast their votes today to, to decide the next federal government. So with a closer look at what the latest polls are saying and how the results could unfold, we're joined by pollster uh, Daryl Bricker, Ipsos CEO of Public Affairs. Daryl, great to see you. This is the day we've all been waiting for. Oh, my should, I just, should I just, I'm, I'm just hitting you a little news that there's election going on. Results not out as yet. Nobody, no, results not out. Also, I have a video of a, um, I want to say, I want to say, I saw a large sawmill get quality selection at the lowest price of large sawmill. If you really want wood, you have to go down by lal. You have teak, apple, mat, cedar, mahogany. They say lal is the wood, man. You take my position, lal? <laughs> so lal, you see lal sawmill and the dance also. Oh. And then we have Imaging Center today, started off officially, Central Imaging Center. They're doing ultrasound, general vascular 40, ultrasound, breast cancer screening packages, and much more CT scans, all your scans and whatnot. You get down there to Central Imaging. Remember, support our people, yeah? Support our people. I saw a video. Just tell me a little more about that. Go ahead. Breaking a diabetes associate, trying to be go. Success treat sugarness. Go ahead. Let me see these fellas on them. Okay, okay, now well, he ate already. Watch, watch, watch. He breaking diabetes center. Association. Breaking a diabetes association trying to success she should go on a post of interest. Entered office and sold a quantity of valuable items on Wednesday. Watch and watch him good. Open up the lines. Watch, watch, watch. He go on. Any people think and take up. It's going to be posted on my page, so we're going to make him a superhero. Anybody have information, get in contact with me. Look, he come back again. You have diabetes? You'll get it, joke, don't worry. You'll, you'll, you'll get it. And you take all the shoes by the door. Watch him, watch him, watch him. Anybody know this guy? Wait now. Wait. Wait. I wonder if he related to the fella who was in the robbery by the supermarket with the fake gun boy. Yeah. 
Yeah, by Sam. It's about, huh? I, I don't know. Because he had to be from the zone. Also, Ryan, um, also looking for Ryan Ratten from Chagona District. Wanted after report of wounded with intent was made for ch chopping it off his ex girlfriend. Wounded with intent. So we need to find Ryan. You need to get in contact with me. It is alleged. Something with you and your girlfriend and things. So get in contact with me. You know, we had seven murders. Also, we had seven murders on Friday. Seven murders between Friday afternoon to t and, and today. Also, we had, um, just to let you know, Pearl Ragunanan from Church Street, Chase Village, passed away. Pearl Ragunanan, that is Dave Ragunanan's mother. So, Pearl Ragunanan from Church Street, our condolences. I know them well. I know Dave well. And, um, well, she just passed away in hospital. Not, 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 nothing to do with COVID or anything. She was ailing for some time. But that's his mom, and it's so, so sad. And also, condolences to Dave and Dave Ragunan and, and, um, and family. Also, ladies and gentlemen, my great, my great, my great friends, great, great people, Mr. and Mrs. Akulu, 51 years, love like dove. Now, Akulu is my boy. Watch him, watch him. They are really nice people. You know, I went to one, I think I went to one of the anniversaries either last year. I think it was last year or year before. Yeah. Happy anniversary to, the, to Mr. and Mrs. Akalu. They're the owners of Shiklisha. Great friends of mine. You know, out of time, I have so much to tell you. And also, happy belated, to, uh, happy, happy belated birthday to Selwyn Perry from Queens, New York. Also, happy related birthday to you, um, Selwyn. He's from Queens, New York. And I'm looking for this guy. He needs to get in contact with me. Carlos Bess. Yeah. Carlos, could you get in contact with me, please? Anybody know where I can locate this guy? I, 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 I'm, tr I'm trying to reach him. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out of time. I'm really out of time, but you're ready. You're, you find out some things today. You find out some things today. So those of you who wish to get here, uh, make sure... Let me tell you something. It is, not too, it is not cheap to advertise on my show. You know why? Ads based on viewership. And we have the most viewership by far. So it costs a lot, but you may, you'll make a lot of money. So I'm just coming out and telling you one time now that if you really want to get a number one show, it's like Super Bowl. Always get on a program where everybody's watching. Don't look for package. First, ask for viewership. Remember, I tell on national television. Every day I teach about TV, you know. Every day. So I, I'm wrapping up now. I have to go. I have to go. This is Ian Allen. This is Crime Watch. I'll be back tomorrow. Remember, Delta come from Mayaro. President coming first week in October, state visit. Also, Del and Rowley hiding because he afraid to answer. Remember, I tell you that Friday he wouldn't jump out. They're going to jump out. They're jumping out. Ask the CMO and DL Singh, what about the autopsy that was just done three days ago? Ask, ask Professor Hubert Daisley. Tell him Ian Allen said, you call him and ask him. And he wouldn't deny it. Nobody needs a great guy. He wouldn't deny it. But you have to ask the CMO, how come all the covering up that? This is Ian Allen. This is Crime Watch. They just can't touch this. Good night. Yo, this is jungle loud. This is this is this is jungle loud. Crime Watch. This is this is jungle loud there and the hunt is on. A jungle loud there and the hunt is on. We gonna hunt you down. We gonna hunt you down.